Ms. Weber. Three brief, brief comments about the university actors are facing reprisals in Venezuela. First, mm -hmm. during last month, at least six university students and professors faced <coughs> reprisals for defending human rights <coughs> and after their cooperation with the Office of the High Commission for Human Rights <coughs> during its visit to Venezuela in March. The cases of Rolly Villas Villasmin or Marlon Diaz are examples. Second, as human rights centers from universities advocated for human rights before international bodies, universities have been suffered a budget asphyxia by the state. Universities only get the two or three percent of the minimum budget required to work. Three, presidents from main public universities in Venezuela associated uh, in the ABERU are victims of retaliation for denouncing lack of democracy and human rights in Venezuela. After they met with the High Commissioner during its her visit, they have been threatened for possible criminal increase. We salute the reference of university autonomy by the High Commissioner, but we request a, high, a wider recognition. As Venezuelan civil society, we need a public statement from the UN rejecting harassments against universities. Democracy is not possible without universities. Thank you.